Hello everybody, Azumi here and welcome to Parasite Eve 2. I decided to jump straight back into the second one after finishing the first one. And let's go ahead and get started. This game basically is completely different from the first one. It was either loved or hated pretty much. December 2000. September 2000. Can't read there. September. So she's become a, become an NMC hunter in LA. I caught the creatures as they headed west from New York. We know we never saw any of the mutant mitochondria that Eve created again. The creatures numbers were dwindling. End of my struggle was in sight. Until one chilly late summer evening. You killed a innocent there, Aya. She's just not in the zone today. <clears throat> this is Mr. Pierce. No, we're not going to do any more gun training for now. I already know how to do it. Head through this door. The music is very much like the first game. That was Hal, I presume. Hal's the boss. There's a problem at the Acropolis Tower downtown. So I gotta be down there in 10 minutes, okay? Last time I checked out a creature sighting, it was just a salesman in a fluffy chicken suit. No such luck this time. They've already called in SWAT. store I have to get ready first which basically just means walk in here and talk it to this lady in here this is like your store for the time being. 
which I don't need anything because I don't have any bounty points yet. I haven't killed anything. You gotta have currency in this game. Let's talk to him and let's get ready and go. There's not much you can do in that part of the game yet. Or ever for that much. The Acropolis Tower. Uh oh. At least Aya drives a nice car. It's classic. It won't let you run in this part of the game. Because the camera's moving too much. There's too much going on. here towards the front door oh, it kind of took over there on its own that was the helicopter yeah no survivors FBI It's a fake FBI badge Alright, time for us to head on in there Aya and kill some monsters And see what's going on Or monster hunters. Yeah, I'm sure after the events of the first game, there would be some kind of organization set up to kind of fight monsters now. Here we go, it wastes no time, puts us right into the building. Goes straight towards this way. Oh. My God. This was SWAT. The stench of gunpowder and blood. Bodies lying atop each other. The SWAT's the best and still. Ooh, what the heck is that thing? Well, I suppose I need to answer the phone. Alright, it's Baldwin calling me. SWAT. Okay, yeah. 
we need more information no I'm not gonna save the game yet we're going to go in this door here mind you I'm probably not gonna go for every single item in the game freeze freeze I think that was the first spoken word in the whole game All except for this lady, a civilian. Gotta go save her. Where is she? Probably still in the cafeteria. And then he conveniently gives me the cafeteria key. The controls in this game are a little wonky. So if I run out of controller wild sometimes, it's just how this game acts. It's hard to control. Now another thing about this game is, is you basically have infinity ammo as long as you have a box to like one of these around. You just can keep running back and filling your ammo up. So it's pretty handy. There's a recovery too, which is essentially the medicine from the first game. Uh oh. That looks like that monster that was up there a minute ago. Throw a fireball at him. Ah, oh, he bit me. Now this game's a little bit more active time than the other one. Than the first game. It plays more like a Resident Evil, Silent Hill type thing. More like Resident Evil 4, I'd say. That guy died. Obviously. Well, no good. He's gone, definitely. I think there's an item down here. Chair's falling on its side. A gyro left half eaten. Well, if there is something down here, I don't know exactly where to click to find it. Oh well. I can live without it. This, this dude in here has a little trick to beating him anyway. He's, or she, I should say, is pretty easy. Ma'am, you're safe now. Uh, I don't know about that. I, uh, just kind of slumped over in the floor there. Now she's transforming into a some kind of monster. I don't know what to call that. I guess she don't need glasses anymore. Definitely not going to need them in a minute.
Alright, so turn around. Run. Let him get about right there. And get in the corner. And just hopefully he gets stuck on the table. Yep. There we go. I've stuck him on the table so he can no longer get any closer or she. And I will just stand here and shoot until this monster is dead. Easy as pie. It's too stupid to go around a table. Let's investigate the body. I've never seen this type of creature before. Odd, there's some kind of metal implant behind the ear cavity. What's this? A metallic implant. Uh-oh. I, uh... Bam! That's how you do it. He's got a real gun. We're going to need bigger guns. I call Miss for backup now. Okay, so that means we gotta go back up here to the phone and call for backup. Two of them. You ain't getting me this time. Too quick for ya. Oh, no. I oh, still got him with it, though. Stay still. There you go. Just gotta be quick on your feet. Spray can. It's all just healing and... Uh, status removal items pretty much I always make sure and go over here find to your ammo stash and every time you f do a couple of fights and refill because you go through some ammo in this game a lot especially when you get automatic firing guns so I'm supposed to use the phone call in for backup a new species mimicking human form. I see. I'm sorry, but I can't send support. All our hunters are in the field. That's right. This may not be much help, but you have clearance to use any discarded weapons you find. Use them well. That is all. Agent Carradine has something transferring. I heard what happened. What's up with those shape-changing NMCs? That implant you picked up might tell us a few things. Be sure to bring it back. But be careful, Aya. Yep, we're going to save it here because this is a good point for me to end this video. Um, this is part one of Parasite Eve 2. Um, thank you for watching, and I'm definitely going to play this game to completion. And please give me a like and subscribe if you want me to keep playing this. And have a good day.